Hey guys, it's day two with uh, my rotifers here on this particular vessel. And I just got done uh, dosing a little bit more food in there. I'm doing three milliliters twice a day. And you can see that uh, the water is quite green. Um, I think it said I have to go three or four days before I can harvest these. These are on day two and a half, and I just fed them as well, and you see how dark that is. Um, this one is going to be harvested for the first time tomorrow. Uh, this is gonna be my very first rotifer harvest, and I'm excited about it, nervously excited, because I don't know what to expect. Uh, I've been doing all the reading and research I can about harvesting them and uh, growing them. Um, if you guys have, if anyone out there has grown and harvested rotifers and would like to reach out to me i'd love to pick your brain on it but uh i just wanted to give that quick update and um while i'm at it you know i want to talk about the phyto as well you can see the one in the back is growing really well this one is growing good but i'm getting this uh kind of an algae on the side of the container and this is the second time this one has happened i crashed the last one by trying to clean it this time i'm going to leave it and just see what happens um if anyone knows why that's happening i'd love to hear uh, but as far as I can tell, there's no nothing wrong with it. It just has this uh, kind of really fluffy algae growing on it. You get up close there. The phyto is a little bit lighter, probably because of that. And uh, it's probably time that I feed it again, too. So anyway, I catch you guys tomorrow with the, uh, the harvest of my rotifers here.